Hello, Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new video. I hope you're all doing well today. It's lovely and hot out there, so make sure you remember to hydrate. I am having just plain water. Well, actually, it's not plain water. It's water with lemon and mint. Mm. Anyway, if you are new to my channel, hello, my name is Kat. I do lifestyle videos. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel for more content just like this. Click the bell icon while you're there so you get notified whenever I have a new upload. And also you may give this video a thumbs up. I would very much appreciate it. Right, today I have a quick haul for you. The other day we went to Sainsbury's to do some food shopping. We only went in there really quick because we found it really quite cold in the shop. So I've just literally grabbed what we needed and that was it. We didn't even have a chance to go around the shop because we were just both freezing really. Now I am going to start with this one here because I've just noticed after going through this video that I actually didn't show you the tomato that I bought anyway. I bought this tomato and this is only 75 pence and then I got this Del Monte pineapple slices that I need to go with my chicken dish. This one is only one pound. And then Lee Kum Ki Panda Brand Oyster Sauce. This one is £2.20 and it is 510 grams. I love my oyster sauce. If you haven't tried it yet, mix your oyster sauce with soy sauce in your stir fry and they are lovely. And then I got this celery. This one is 450 grams for 43 pence. And then I got close cup white mushrooms. This one is 85 pence. And then I got this fair trade banana. This one is 74 pence. The bananas are actually 73 pence per kilogram. And it was just a little bit over than a kilo. So I paid 74 pence for this one. Now this garlic is actually a pretty good price. This one is a pound for four. I normally get my garlic from home bargains because it's usually 59 pence for a pack of four, just like this. And they're slightly bigger. But the last time we went there, there wasn't any, so I had to get it somewhere else. And then I got these spring onions. This one here is 37 pence. And then a bag of bean sprouts for 90 pence. I normally make my own bean sprouts, but I haven't made for some time now, so I had to get it somewhere else. <laughs> this baby cucumbers is a pound for 200 grams. And then... These strawberries are really good quality. They are beautiful in color. They are actually looking absolutely gorgeous. And they are only two pounds. I saw this onion potatoes. I was actually looking for new potatoes because I said to my husband, I just realized we haven't actually had new potatoes this spring and it's summer now. So I spotted this one. It's called onion potatoes and it says it's grown by Philip Kingsmill in Norfolk. It looks a bit funny. It's quite elongated than the new potatoes. The new potatoes are lovely round ones, but this is quite elongated. This one is also a pound. It tastes all right, except it's a little bit earthy. Not my favorite, but it's fine. I also grabbed a bag of red onions. This one is one pound for a kilogram. The sweetheart cabbage is 60 pence. I must admit the quality is not as good as the one I got from Asda. This one is a lot smaller, but then again, it's 60 pence. And then I got this pineapple. This one is 75 pence. They're slightly smaller than the one from Morrison's, but I thought they were a pound. Apparently, the receipt says it's 75 pence. So now I understand why it's obviously smaller because it's only 75 pence. Then I got these beef sausages. There's about eight in this packet. And this one is pound seventy. We normally get beef sausages from Morrison's, but I thought we'll try this Sainsbury's brand and see what it's like. And then I got these chicken legs. This one is one kilogram for pound sixty-nine, And I put it straight in the freezer because I was thinking of actually grilling it when we came home. But then I didn't have a time because I got too busy in the garden. So I decided to put it in the freezer and just defrost it whenever I need it. And then I also got the Sizzler steaks. This one is three pounds and it's 350 grams. Um, this is a Silverside steaks. 
and they're very thinly cut and the next day i decided to marinate it in a bulgogi sauce it was tender it was beautiful and then i got a bag of carrots this one is a pound for a kilogram and then i spotted udon noodles on the oriental side of the shop and i thought oh i love udon noodles when i was in japan this was my favorite of all well i love all japanese noodles really but udon was particularly my favorite so i got one i was quite pleased that this was actually just in um, a single packet so yeah we enjoyed that one totally and i put the leftover grilled beef on the udon noodles and it was gorgeous absolutely beautiful and totally enjoyed it and then on the way to the tail i walked past this clothes section and then i spotted a handbag and i thought oh yeah i could do with that so i grabbed this one this one here is 16 pounds and i always wanted a basic black bag like really plain handbag I just realized I've sent a lot of my handbags to my sisters and I haven't got much left for me. So I thought this one is just a basic black bag that I don't have to worry about what kind of clothes I'm wearing with this. And um, there's a pocket here in front and then a zip so you can actually close it and um, about three pockets inside so I can put my cameras and uh, my phone when we go out and i just really wanted a basic plain black handbag and finally i remember to get myself one so yes that's all i've got for you on this haul of the time being enjoy the weather enjoy this beautiful sunshine that we are having be safe out there and look after yourselves and i will see you very soon bye for now Mwah.